Well, this morning we continue our series called Two Americas. The goal is to show different perspectives and introduce you to parts of southeast Wisconsin you may not be familiar with. So right now we're heading 60 miles southwest of Milwaukee to Walworth, where two teachers collectively hold more than a dozen roles. Our Julia Fellow reports. Just a couple miles from the shores of Geneva Lake sits Bigfoot High School, where teachers Stacy Shepard and Angela Galata are hard at work preparing for a very busy day. I currently teach in our science department. I teach physics, honors physics. I teach biology, regular and honors level. I also teach our engineering classes. Alternative education teacher, social studies teacher, director of assessment. I'm also one of our teacher mentors. Oh, and after school, Ms. Galata helps with the volleyball and basketball scorebook. Nice, Stacy, nice. And Ms. Shepard is the bowling club coach. Oh, so close. So you are a jack of all trades. Sometimes, yeah. <laughs> that takes a lot. Yeah, it's you just gotta be a good planner. I, do lists all the time. I have lists everywhere all over the place. Other than that, it looks like everything's good. Okay, thank you. In larger school districts, biology, physics, and chemistry are all taught by different teachers. <laughs> but in smaller districts like Bigfoot, they're all taught by one person. These are your quizzes back finally. During the day, I have like physics one and also honors physics at the same time. In the same classroom? Same classroom. People get that misconception that it's like a seven to three o'clock job and then when the bell rings like we're out the door but these women love what they do are you going to do that as a career later on okay. that type of thing does that make sense yeah. and are happy to get paid for the extra work most of my friends that are teachers will work over the summer and it opens them up to more opportunities i'm going to school full-time ms shepherd hopes to become a director of special education at bigfoot i have a seven-year-old son who has down syndrome and i wanted to be able to share that parent perspective. This may be an important lesson for all of us to understand how crucial teachers roles are in our children's lives and the fabric of our community. Nice. Good job, Jacob. Julia Fellow, TMG4 News. Oh, tired just hearing about all those right? jobs. Thank you, Julia. We have more stories from our Two Americas series that go in depth on the different sides to our country. To check those out, just head to TMJ4.com and click on Two Americas.